What's going on guys? Welcome to episode 16 of my Forest Let's Play or part 2 of episode 15, whatever you want to call it. I don't care because I'm well excited. I can't even tell you. I've been so excited to get this part recorded because we are going into the depths of the beast. We are going to find Timmy and I don't know where to go to find him. But what I'll do first of all, bang this on because I do not know what to expect. I'm gutted. I've got six sticks left and my home is outside the entrance to the door. So I, I have no idea what I'm going to do. But we shall carry on because we are troopers. Um, let me make a bomb just in case. Uh, what the bloody hell am I doing? No, wrong bit. There we go. There we go. We got there eventually. But I tell you what what is weird is hearing nothing. All I'm hearing is like electricity going to the lights right now. No crazy people laughing in the distance. I'll be honest, I miss seeing my cronies, my neighbours going for the morning jog. I've been here a day. And I'm missing home already. Uh, I heard something moving just then. That's never a good thing. A room with crosses. What is this? Who's that? Sahara male. I can't even read that. It's a picture of a girl though. She been camped up here? Do you know where Timmy is? Hello? Oh, come on man. Bibles, crosses. <gasps> no. This is just wrong. Going down some creepy little... Which way? Right or left? Right. Oh, this is so nerve-wracking. I'm going to try left first. I, I hate going... I don't want to go too far ahead and miss something. Oh, I don't like these little narrow bits. I'm just waiting for something to walk around the corner and run after me. Hey, up. Is this where she's been camped? No. Little action figure. Flowers. Is that a baby's arm sticking out of the vent? Oh, this... Man up, Sai. Man up. I'm trying. I am trying, guys. Bear with me. I may go quiet a little bit here and there, but... This is, like, weird. Because I'm not used to it. <gasps> what? What is this place? This is some sort of facility. Definitely. Do I need to eat? Yes, I do. Thanks for that. Don't know how long it's been there, but it was tasty. Can I get a drink? Oh, sweet. Good job I didn't burn all that money, innit? I'm, like, really conscious that something's going to run around the corner, so... It just doesn't feel right. How many of these can I have? Give me more. That's all. All she wrote. What else have we got? Coffee. Oh, are you here? Don't need any more food. I'll eat it anyway. Getting them achievements. 
But this is just weird. Doesn't like whatever went down here was a good thing though. Look at the state of it. Is this some, I'm w worried that there's nowhere for me to save. Do I go? No, I'm not going to go up there just yet. This looks like another narrow corridor. Let's check out this gaff first. No, I don't want to sit down. I'll take some coins though. More coins. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, you can't go in here. No. No smash windows or anything. Looks like we have to go up, folks. Back into the narrow little crevice areas, man. Don't like it one bit. Like I was saying in the last episode, I don't know what's worse. Hearing things or not hearing things. And right now I'm not hearing anything. Which is making me really, really nervous. Can you see anything through these vents? No. Oh. <gasps> I thought I heard like a wheel a wheelchair rolling then. What is that noise? I think it's just my guy's shoes on the floor. <laughs> Can I go in here now? Don't laugh at me guys, it's not funny. Yeah, so much scientific going on down here. Oh, you see, it's showing you already. You're getting into a bad place now. Let's put a bit of blood and guts on the floor. I'm hearing like babies or something. Oh, for goodness sake, you little rats. Oh. It's not funny. You're dead. Oh, I don't fancy going down there just yet. Shut that door. <sighs> this is like tests gone wrong. Are these mummies and daddies that of these babies? Sorry, I just had to. Oh, so does that lead the same way? I'm guessing it. <gasps> heard something. Oh, shoot. Um, yeah, we're going to have to use this. Be quiet. Shh. I don't think he knows we're here. Kaboom, son. So that comes out there. That's from that other door. Yeah. Sorry, I'm, if, if you're here for a rush through, this ain't the right channel. I want to take in everything that's going on down here. What is this? These are like eyes. Oh, blubber man. And we thought the eight legged freaks were bad. Do 
Janelle, I know that you guys have been following through the past however many episodes. Sorry, I thought I could hear running then. Yeah, I definitely can hear running or something. Property of Megan. I wonder if that's what she's called then. I know you've been watching for the past however many episodes. But obviously, in between episodes, I've been going and gathering stuff. So I've kind of been on this game now for like, according to my say, 45 days. And... Still can't put the flaming picture in front of his torch. Megan Cross, she seems to be like a big part of this right now. But yeah, 45 days I've been living in the woods with rabbits and stuff like that. So to come somewhere like this is just like mind-blowing right now. What's this saying? Oh god, I need to calm down. Oh, let me put the torch away. What's this saying? Earnings report Sahara Therapeutics Orientation Slideshow number two. Longevity medicine through Jarius Project. Ma Matthew Cross. Subject 375B5. 12 years old? Six arms <laughs> quality nickname. What translating results to adult longevity? Parents willing to spend money. Purchase of peninsula. What? Can I get? Yep, I have that computer part. It's like just too quiet for my liking right now. Get the torch back on. It's dark over here. Oh, that shadow from the flaming plant. I'm only 3%. I've got eight packs. That's all good. It's all good. Don't panic just yet, say. <coughs> Excuse me. There's not much to collect down here, apart from what we've been collecting already, like medication and stuff like that. What's this? Light, please. Your employment, something about Matt, employment. I don't even know where to find it. Timmy drawings, oh, whatever. Matt. Termination of employment, unlucky mate. Somebody's laughing. And I'm guessing it's not a former employee. Is that soon? Look at that dude hung there. Yeah. That's the option he took. kind of like good to see you mate after such a long time I can hear babies again yeah I can kind of understand that mate where where is the sound of that baby coming from Right, there's a few of them here. Damn, flaming babies, man. They make some creepy ass noises. What else is in here? This is like telling a story right now. Incubators. What's this alcohol? Take them, take that. 
more cloth. I can hear something really bad down here. Um, why is my guy's energy so low? Get some energy in you. Might as well top that up. I don't know whether I should. What on earth? What is this? I don't want to. I'm going to check out the room first just in case I, I like look at that and it unleashes something. What's this set to second? Second artifact. I don't know what that means just yet. Sorry, mate. I don't trust just in case. See, I've seen these horror movies. They don't do that, and then the dude comes alive. Torch, mate. Well, I can't see it. There's a coffee stain on a piece of paper. What on earth? Guy gets on my flaming nerves not putting it in front of his. Megan's arrival. Second. What? Which have we seen? Uh, let's watch this. Megan's arrival. I'm not sure if you can see that very well. Let's see if we can get it in the light or something. It's a little girl on a helicopter by the sounds of it. And that's it. She's pointing. Okay. Don't know what that's got to do with anything. More paint. Always got to paint yourself up. Don't know why. Can't get in there. I see. I hear a crazy laughing. I will. I'm just checking out everything. See if something happens and I haven't collected all this. Uh, somebody's through that wall. I can hear him. Lawyer book. What's that say? When I grow up, I want to be a lawyer. Alright, okay. <gasps> Surely that's got to be Timmy. Is that it? Game over? Just pulled his head off a spike. Quite emotional, this. Poor little guy. This is all your fault, Dad, for getting on a plane where you and your son are the only passengers. Gonna save him. <gasps> Does dad have to give his own life to save his son? <gasps> well, it's not letting me go in here. Right then, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> But we're going to call the episode there. Is this? I'm so buzzing right now and I want to carry on. But I can't. 
I can't. We've got to cut this up. We've got to cut it up. So I'm going to leave it there. Um, if you have enjoyed the episode, please give it a thumbs up. Share it with your pals. Join us on Facebook, Twitter. Links are in, in the description. And part three of this uh, will come very soon. In fact, what day with tomorrow or today, Friday. Next episode will be Monday. And I will see you guys in the next episode. I cannot wait. Take it easy.